Good evening. Good evening, teacher. How are you, Oscar? Good evening, How are you? Teacher. Hello, Michelle. Hi, teacher. Hello. Hi, Jose. How are you? Okay. Good. How is everybody today? Um, work. All right, good. How is everybody doing today? Hello? Hi. Hi, how are you today, Michelle? I'm fine, teacher. Everything okay. Oh, okay. What about you, Oscar? How are you today? I'm fine, teacher. I'm home. Okay. Let me see. And you, Jose? Hi, teacher. Sorry. Hi. No, it's okay. How are you today? How are you today? Mm -hmm. <clears throat> um, sorry. Take care. Take care of my kids. Okay. Okay, that's good. That's good. Okay, um, so remember, what did we practice yesterday? Every question in what, one word, we have often. In what, in future, present, or past? Uh, at present? Simple present. Simple present. Very good. And what is simple present, Oscar? The action. Uh, uh, for, for example, um, a dinner in the moment, or a, everything. It. Okay, but remember that the definition of simple present is what. Uh, la acción que estamos haciendo siempre. Mm, no, uh, not really. No, no. Simple present is an action. No, no. Uh, we frequently do. Okay. Yes. Okay. Not in this moment, not in past, not in future. Lo que hacemos frecuentemente. Hold on, please, let me see. Okay, remember, we have done simple future. Going to? Yes. So simple future is, for example, I am going to the verb 
and complement. Remember? Okay. Simple future is I am going to the verb and the complement. So please look at the word simple. Don't complicate. What is simple future? What is future? Future is tomorrow, next week, next year, Saturday, Sunday is future, correct? Mm -hmm. Yes, yes or no? Yes. Okay. So, one more time, simple future, futuro simple, no se compliquen. Esto no es simple. Depende de la cuarentena. Si la cuarentena mejora, quizás en Navidad yo voy a ir a Estados Unidos, bla, bla, bla. Eso no es simple future. Porque están metiendo condiciones, etc., etc., etc. Futuro simple es mañana voy a almorzar pollo. El sábado voy a ir al súper. El voy a, voy a, voy a. Going to, I'm going to, I'm going to. The verb and the complement. So give me an example, Oscar, in simple future with tomorrow. I am tomorrow morning. Uh, tomorrow morning is the compliment. But please start with I am going to. I am going to eat a bread and the tomorrow. breakfast. Tomorrow. 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 Very good. Very good. He said, I am going to eat bread and breakfast tomorrow. Very good. That is simple future. That's not complicated. Okay. Jaime, give me an example with Sunday. Okay. Hello, everybody. Um, Hello. I am going to eat uh, uh, fish. fish or beef on the lunch. Sunday. Sunday. Very okay. good. Very and, good. And the lunch, Sunday. All right. Jose, give me an example with next week. Next week, mm -hmm. I'm going to I'm going to visit. No, 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 sorry. Okay, I'm going to visit my grandma. Next week. Okay, good. I'm going to visit my grandma next week. Very good. Maudi. Hello, Maudi. Hi, teacher. Hi. Hello. Hello. Maudi, give me an example in simple future Hello. with. Give me an example with. If I have the chance or the opportunity to meet somebody, I would like to. Qué <laughs> <laughs> mal, your wow. bad teacher. <laughs> no, no Maudi, mentiras. Give me an example. Give me an example with hey, Christmas. Bad. Give me an example with Christmas. Uh, I'm going to uh, eat. Uh, meat and Merry Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm going to eat meat and Christmas. No. 
in Merry in Christmas, Christmas now. In, in Merry Christmas now, it's meet in Christmas. Meet Christmas. Uh, okay. I'm going to eat meat in Christmas. I'm going to eat in Christmas. Okay. Eat I'm, in Christmas. Okay, wait. I'm going to eat meat in Christmas. Repeat. Uh, okay. I'm going to mm -hmm. meat eat in Christmas. Mm, repeat, please. I'm going to meet no. it in Christmas. Wait. I ah. I am going to meet no verbo. Ah. I am going to eat. I I meat. going to eat mm -hmm. meat Christmas. Exactly. Very good. Thank you. Okay. Mich Michelle. Mm. Hello. Hello. Um, after class, give me an example with after class. Um, I am going to watch the nef the Netflix after class. Oh, very good. What a movie or um a series. Very good, very good. Thirteen reasons why. Thirteen reasons. Yes. Oh, okay, good. Um, well, se imaginan una cuarentena en los ochentas o noventas, al principio de los noventas. Ay, no. Wow. No me toca TCS y Blockbuster. <risa> viendo la película del 6 y sin internet no, no internet no cell phones no no TV ya estuviéramos muertos yes. del estrés yes estrés ok very good so that is simple future, correct? Great. Simple future, como lo dice la palabra, simple, don't complicate. Okay. Um, next is simple present. What is simple present? Do you remember? Do. Lo que hacemos frecuentemente. What we do. Exactly. What we do frequently. Frequently. <laughs> Okay, um, I would say. so um, simple present is no, no more I am. No, it's only I, the verb, and the complement. So simple present is an action you do in present time. Y como le repito, no se vaya, no se vaya a confundir. Okay, good, yes. Eh, como le digo, no se vayan a confundir porque la gente piensa que presente es en este momento y no. Es tiempo presente. Por ejemplo, eh, yo antes fumaba, hoy no fumo. O sea, en tiempo presente ya no fumo. Pero no es estoy fumando. Mm -hmm. eh, ok. Por ejemplo, hay mucha gente ahorita que en este momento no trabaja. O hay gente que trabaja. Por la cuarentena. ¿Yes? Sí. So, it's a frequent action. So, um, give me an example, Oscar, of simple present with every, every night. I... I running 
Uh, for, for example, I I had I had dinner every night. Every night. Excellent. I eat dinner every night. Okay. Um, Jaime, give me an example with simple present with every day. Every day. Okay. I take a shower every day. Okay. Good. Good for you. Jose. Jose Santa Maria, give me an example with every Christmas. Uh, Merry Christmas. No, Merry Christmas es un dicho, okay? Es Feliz Navidad, pero la palabra se llama Christmas. El, el, el evento es Christmas. Christmas. Mm -hmm. So give me an example with, eh, ah, es que no, no dije Merry Christmas, dije every Christmas. Every day, every week, every month, every year, every Christmas. Do you see? Do you see, Jose? Lo que siempre hace en Navidad. Ah. Jose, ¿qué es every? Hey. Cada. Cada, exactly. So, uh, give an example of simple present with every Christmas. I eat <laughs> every Christmas. Okay, thank you. Puede ser un poquito más específico. Por ejemplo, I eat turkey every Christmas. I eat tamales every Christmas. I eat chicken sandwich every Christmas. All right, oh, okay. Michelle, your turn, please. Hello. Hi. Give me an example with every Sunday. I go to the church every Sunday. Good. I go to church every Sunday. Very good. Maudi. Maudi? Hi. 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 Give me an example with every day before you wake up and take a shower. <laughs> No, mentiras. Uh, Maudi. Ay, teacher, usted me, me deja la luna. <laughs> no. Give Qué me, malo. Give me an example with every day for breakfast. Um, I eat um, sweet bread breakfast. Every day. For breakfast. Every day breakfast. Okay. Listen, please. I eat sweet bread every day for breakfast. Repeat. Okay. I eat sweet bread mm -hmm. for breakfast every day. Excellent. That's 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 perfect. That's good too. Very good. All right. So that's simple present. Very good. So um, what's my mouse? Okay. My mouse is not working good. Okay. Um, Michelle. Uh huh. What is good the hi? What is simple future? The definition. Um. Is Ay, <laughs> lo que voy a hacer. Okay, good. Exactly. Simple future is an action it's, that is going to happen. 
Okay. O se puede decir, eh, I am going to do. Ajá, uh -huh. an action I am going to do. Una acción que va a pasar, una acción que voy a hacer. No problem. Ok. Yes. Yes. Um, y como le repito, no se compliquen. Porque hay gente que me gusta complicarse. Teacher, ¿cómo se dice? ¿Qué voy a comer mañana? Depende. Si mañana me pagan, voy a comprar comida y voy a hacer una gran cena para mi familia. Pero si no me pagan, voy a comer huevos con frijoles. Y, va, va, y empiezan a dar una gran historia. Le digo, wow. ¿Qué quiere hablar? ¿Futuro simple o...? o o, ah, contar, o contar una gran historia. Yes. Eso, eso ya no es futuro simple. Futuro simple es la pregunta simple y, y la respuesta simple. Y por eso también el presente simple es eso. Todos los días, yo como todos los días, yo veo tele todas las noches, yo bebo café cada hora. Ok, simple wow. present. Ah, maybe, pero mm -hmm. I, I drink coffee maybe four times a day. Cuatro o cinco veces al día. Cada cuatro veces. No, four times a day, every day. Ah, okay. Okay, now look. Today, we're going to practice simple, simple past. Mm. Simple past. Is this similar like simple present, but only this is past. What is past? Yesterday. Do you see this yesterday? Yesterday is past, correct? No, maybe, I don't know. Class, yesterday is past, yes or no? Yes. Okay. Yes. Thank you. So, simple past is yes. Yes, yes. Thank you, okay, yesterday last week guess last week semana pasada semana pasada last month el mes pasado el mes pasado el mes pasado mm -hmm. last year el año pasado last sunday el domingo pasado entonces entendieron que cuando ponemos last Vamos a entender el pasado, last Christmas. Lo que ya pasó. O el último, tal vez. Uh -huh. uh -huh. yeah. Last Christmas, I gave you my heart. And the very no, me da el pasado. Day, you gave it away. ¿Se acuerdan de esa canción, la, la típica navideña? No. De, de George Michael. Last Christmas, I gave you my heart. The very next day, you gave it away. Okay, but every time you say last, <laughs> every time you say last is past. Okay? So, simple past is... What do you...
Okay, look. What did you, this is past. Remember, this is very important. We are in simple past is what did you, when did you, where did you, the verb and the complement. The answer is I, look, the verb in past, in the question, the verb is normal. In the answer, the verb is in past and the complement. For example, if the verb is eat, what is the past of eat? Eating. No, the past is eight. 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 So this would be a normal question. What did you, the verb and the complement, so what did you eat yesterday? The answer is I, what's next? Eight. Eight. Chicken. Yesterday. Okay. Okay. I ate chicken yesterday. Do you understand? Yes. Okay, let me see. Oscar, what did you eat for lunch today? Oh, yes, sir. Okay, Jaime, what did you eat for lunch today? I, I ate in lunch. Mm -hmm. In lunch. Okay, I ate, I ate, um, Beef lunch for lunch yesterday. for lunch today. Okay, aquí practiquen mucho. Oigan bien la pregunta. Listen, what did you eat for lunch today? No yesterday, today. What did you okay. eat for lunch today? Okay, so repeat. What did you eat for lunch today? I, I ate uh, beef uh, for lunch to date. Very good, Jaime, very good. Can you repeat please with more fluent? I okay. ate, repeat, I ate. I ate. Beef. Beef. For lunch today. For lunch to date. Okay, now repeat. I ate beef. I bay if. I ate beef. I ate beef. For lunch today. For lunch to date. Excellent. Douglas, what did you eat for breakfast today? Oh, uh, conste, eh, pregunta, pregunta. ¿Por qué pasado si yo estoy diciendo today? Yo le pregunté a Jaime, ¿qué comió en el almuerzo hoy? ¿Qué es lo pasado ahí? Ok, hello, comió. Hi. Hola. ¿Comió? Comió. Sí, pero el pasado ahí es lunch. El almuerzo hace la pregunta okay. pasado. el almuerzo, sí. Porque ya pasó. Ya pasó. Porque hay, generalmente alguien me ha preguntado, ¿pero por qué es pasado si está terminando con today? Y today no ha terminado. ¿Cierto? Mm -hmm. Today no ha terminado, pero lunch sí. 
Okay. Ajá, por eso le pregunté, what did you eat for lunch today? I ate lunch. Uh, I'm sorry, I ate beef for lunch today. Okay, Douglas, what did you eat for breakfast today? Okay, I think today we have a bad connection or something. Um, Hi. Douglas, hello. 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 Hi, Douglas. Sir. Hi. What did you eat for breakfast today, Douglas? I ate eggs for the breakfast today. Excellent. Thank you. Maudi. Hi. Hello, Maudi. <laughs> <laughs> Ay, no, teacher. <laughs> A ver, dígame. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> Maudi, what did you eat for your birthday? Vaya, fácil. Por favor, otra vez repetir la pregunta. Yes. What did you eat for your birthday? Birthday. Mm. What do you eat for the birthday? Uh, I had uh, a I don't know. <laughs> Remember in your birthday, what did you eat? Cake? Chicken, pizza, meat, barbecue. In your birthday, Maudi. Happy birthday, Maudi. Uh, Happy okay, birthday. yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, okay. What did you eat in your birthday? I eat. I ate. Uh, uh, I ate. Meats, barbecue. In my birthday. In my birthday. Nice. Thank you, Mauti. <laughs> okay. Okay. Um. Thank you, Jose. Okay. Hi. Hi, Jose. How are you? I'm fine. You? I'm okay. Jose, what did you eat? No, no. Where? Where did you eat pupusas last Friday? <laughs> last Friday. Where did you eat? Where did you eat pupusas for last Friday? Ah, quitémosle el for aquí. Where did you eat pupusas last Friday? I eat, I ate pupusas um, on my office. Okay. Last Friday. Last Friday. Very good. Okay. Mich Michelle. Hello. Hi, Michelle. Hi. Where did you eat in your anniversary? Mm, I ate. Uh, I don't remember. <laughs> you can say you're a Tony Roman's face. Yes, yeah, I see Tony Roman. <laughs> In the last anniversary, no. Um, bueno, supongamos que I ate in Tony Roma's my last anniversary. Good. All right, very good. So this is 
this is the question. So, what did you? Ahora, yo entiendo. <clears throat> la pregunta es fácil. La respuesta es un poco más difícil porque hay que saber cómo se dice el verbo en pasado. Porque en la pregunta el verbo siempre se dice igual. ¿Por qué? Porque did significa que es pasado. What did you eat? What did you drink? What did you play? Ok, entonces, um, tu, 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 tu. está eat, eight. Vamos a ver, eat, eight, drink, drink. Teacher. Yes, Michelle. Eh, ¿Verdad que los regula los verbos regulares uh -huh. son los que cambian o los irregulares? Eh, los irregulares, pero en este tiempo no. En el presente perfecto. Cambian cuando, por ejemplo, ahorita estamos aprendiendo yo comí, yo bebí, yo compré. Cambian es cuando yo he comido, yo he bebido y yo he comprado. Es cuando se le agrega el ED, ¿verdad? Ajá, algunos, cuando son regulares. Ok. Uh -huh. Cuando veamos, ese, ese es el tiempo presente perfecto. Así se llama. Okay. Que es otro presente. Ok, tenemos IT. Y con usted, hoy, eh, digamos, hoy terminamos. No, creo que es hasta el 11 no, de julio. Hasta la, otra. Ah, hasta la otra semana, creo. Sí, hasta, el otro, hasta la otra semana. Ah, está bien. Ok. Tu, 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 tu. Ok, ven, eat. Do you see eat? Yes. Yeah. The, the past of eat is eat, eight. Eat. The past of drink is drank. The past of buy is bought. Bought. Okay, so. Okay, so here's the question. Okay, so then the question is, yeah. we have the question with when, where, and what did you, the verb, and the complement? For example, where did you eat quesadillas? When did you buy your car? What did you buy in the supermarket? And then the answer is, I ate, I ate quesadillas in, in the restaurant. I bought food in the supermarket. Okay, do you understand? Yes. Okay, entonces vamos a hacer cualquier verbo que ustedes quieran. Aquí va a ir cualquier verbo. Puede ir buy, drink, or eat. Y la respuesta va a ser I, el verbo que escogieron aquí, pero en pasado, and the complement. So, for example, Jaime, please attack Maudi. Hey. <laughs> okay. Hi, Maudi. Next. Hi, Jaime. <laughs> uh, what did you eat? Uh... Okay. What did you? Bye. Uh -huh. 
what did you buy uh, yesterday in the supermarket? Good. Me copió mi pregunta, pero good. <laughs> <laughs> Please, uh, repeat, please. Es que escucho un poco cortado. Okay. What did you buy yesterday uh -huh. in the supermarket? Uh -huh. Oh, what did you eat yesterday in the restaurant? Okay, one question only. What, what is the question? No, no, no. It is shame. It is shame porque... Porque copié la, la pregunta, dice el teacher, entonces por eso la estoy cambiando. <laughs> <laughs> okay, good. Okay. Did. Okay, sería. So yeah, ya se me olvidaron las dos preguntas. <laughs> okay. Pero, <laughs> what did you sería. eat? Uh -huh, what what did you eat yesterday in the restaurant? Eh, bueno, Pincher, ayúdeme con la respuesta porque no sé si estáis segura con eso. Ok, dale. I eat in the past uh, the restaurant Dennis. Ok, but listen to the question very carefully. Repeat the question, Jaime. What did you eat yesterday uh -huh. in the restaurant? I'm okay, más completa, más completa. Okay. No, actually, that's what good. Do you, what, what did you eat for lunch yesterday in the restaurant? Okay. Um... ¿Qué comió ayer en el almuerzo en el restaurante? <laughs> thank you, Jaime, thank you. Uh, <laughs> I eat. Uh, uh, um, I, I. I. In the verb in past. I ate. Good. I ate in the in salad <laughs> in the restaurant. Are okay. Yesterday in the restaurant. Okay. Correct? Entonces sería. I ate. I ate. In salad mm -hmm. yesterday in the restaurant. Good. Yes, very nice. Pero es que es mi turno, Jaime. Your turn, Maudi. Your turn, Maudi. Attack somebody, please. Hi. Eh, no, que, que pregunte a otra persona. Después pregunto yo. Déjenme respirar, please. No, no, pero usted le toca porque ella le respondió y le toca preguntar. Uh, It's here, look. Gosh. When, where, what did you, the verb, the verb can be buy, drink, or eat. Ok. Eh... Quiero ver quiénes están acá. Let me see. You have Oscar, Michelle, Jose, and Douglas. Oscar. Para que vea que no soy negativa, Jaime. <laughs> Oscar, hi. Hi, Mauri. Oscar, eh, where did you... Uh, Ring in the in your lunch. Okay, good. Where did you drink 
in your lunch. Uh, mm -hmm. No, 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 no. Eh, es que no, no, no combina el donde tomó, ¿verdad? Bueno, sí, pero si es más específica. Like, por ejemplo, where did you drink beer in your lunch? Where did you drink coffee ah. in your lunch? Where did you drink um, atol? Ok, voy a formular nuevamente la pregunta entonces. Okay. <laughs> eh, sería, where did you um, drink the coffee in the uh, breakfast? Good. I drank drunk mm -hmm. the coffee and the breakfast yesterday okay oscar please listen listen very carefully to the question maudi repeat the question oscar ponga mi atención please <laughs> <laughs> a ver oscar where did you drink coffee in the breakfast? <laughs> in the breakfast. Okay. I drank coffee in the breakfast. Yes. Uh, ¿Cuándo lo tomó? Shh, no, please, Maudi. No. Ah. Hoy sí la voy a agarrar yo con una pregunta. Ay, no. <laughs> no, don't help. I drink coffee. Buena no persona. Coffee. I drink coffee in my office. Yes, sir. Okay, very good. <laughs> Thank you, Maudi. Thank you, Oscar. <laughs> You see, Oscar, she, uh, Maudi was saying where, no when. Yeah, sí, mm -hmm. el... yeah. So, uh -huh. so here you need to practice the, the listening, everybody. Okay, thank you. Yes. Okay, oh, yo le voy a preguntar a Maudi. Oh, no. Oscar, okay. please ask Michelle. <laughs> hey. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, uh, Michelle, good evening. Hi, good evening. Uh, what did you eat in the dinner yesterday? Good. Uh, is what or what? What? Ah. Uh, repeat, please. <laughs> what did you eat mm -hmm. in dinner yesterday? Okay, I ate uh, beans and um, bananas, no sé cómo se dice, plátano. Plantains. Uh, beans and plantains yesterday in the dinner. Excellent, yeah. Good. Please uh, ask Douglas, good question. Ask Douglas, please. Okay, Douglas. Hi. Hi, Michelle. Hi. Um, when did you buy your last your last shoes? Good. Uh, I. Um, Correct is the very fast ball. How do you say? Uh, help when? me how to say by in fast. Uh, but. But, but, okay. I bought my shoes in the. Adoc. 
Okay, good. Douglas, ask me, please. Okay. Pero le pregunté when. When, when, when don't mm -hmm. the, uh, Oh, okay, in thank a, you. In a thank you. I'm sorry, yo, se lo prometo yo. Cuando. <coughs> no. Okay. <laughs> okay, thank you. Okay, Douglas, uh, where? Cuando, uh, cuando, cuando, sorry. When, when? I, I asking again. I, I do not, I want my shoes in the father's day. Very good. Nice. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, Michelle. <laughs> okay. Welcome. Ask me, Douglas. How much Douglas? Okay. Where did you, did you drink uh, in the last Friday? Oof. Um, drink what? I don't know. I drink cool. No, because you, you told me, you asked me, where did you drink last Friday? But depends. Drink what? Coffee, water, beer? Mm, coffee. Well, oh, okay. Where did you... you Coffee the last Friday. I drank coffee last Friday in my house. In my room. All right. Okay. Okay, good. Now. Okay. Nice. Okay, Maudi. No está Maudi. <laughs> <laughs> Maudi, Maudi, what did you eat for lunch last Father's Day? Um, what? Yes. Oh, vamos a quitar lunch porque pudo haber sido breakfast, lunch, or dinner. What did you eat last Father's Day? Um, I eat the. I ate. <laughs> I ate a meat dinner. I ate meat. Uh, I. I ate meat dinner in the Father's Day. Last Father's Day. Uh, last Father's Day. Very good. Nice. Thank you. <laughs> um, okay. Jaime. Your bad teacher. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, teacher. <laughs> Jaime, what <laughs> what did you eat? What did you eat in the Christmas party? Or what did you eat in the last company Christmas party? Okay. Uh, I ate turkey. I ate turkey in the last, repeat please. The yes. What question. did, yes, what did you five. eat, what did you eat in the last company's Christmas party? Okay. I ate, I ate turkey in the last, Company Christmas party. Very good. Nice. Oscar, what did you eat in your daughter's birthday? I think today we have a bad connection with Oscar. Hmm. 
Ok, entonces le voy a preguntar a Maudi otra vez. <risa> ¡Oscar! <risa> no. no. Ok. Michelle. Michelle. What did you eat? What did you eat in your wedding? <gasps> Baby back ribs. So, yes. <laughs> Uh, I ate baby ribs in my wedding. Okay, good. Okay, class, look, wedding is dun 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 Casarse, in, casamiento. In my last boda. wedding. Ah, boda. <laughs> oh, in your last wedding. Okay. <laughs> no, mentira. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Douglas. Yeah, Where did you eat good quesadillas? Yeah. Oh. I had I had good quesadilla in Sonsonate City in Cienfuegos. In, in Cienfuegos, yeah. man. Si un día voy a Sonsonate, I, I look for Cienfuegos. Okay, okay. When do you come? Yes. Yeah, I'll, I'll tell you when I when I go. <laughs> okay, hey, very good, okay. class. Very good. Eh, como les digo, si se notan, la, las preguntas están, son bien simples. Simples, no solo en gramática, ¿no? Que simple a la hora de hacer la pregunta y responderla. O sea, nada de complicaciones. ¿Me entienden? Entonces, por eso es, por eso es que eh, se llama el futuro simple, el pasado simple. Porque... En estos tiempos, las preguntas se hacen cortas, sencillas y cortas. Yes. Yes. Uh, so, practice, practice Friday, Saturday, Sunday. And next week, we're going to have a conversation. Con los tres tiempos. Conversation, ¿sí? Okay. Okay. Okay, so thank you very much. You have a good okay. weekend. Thank you, teacher. Okay, teachers. Thank you, teacher. Thank you, for all. Thank you. Oscar. Have you had bad, bad connection today, Oscar. Yeah, teacher. I'm sorry. No, no, it's okay. Oh, ya apareció Oscar. Qué barbaridad. <laughs> 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 so